Every year around the world, between 250,000 and 500,000 people suffer a spinal cord injury. And up to 80% of those people suffer from fecal incontinence or constipation. Together, these symptoms are defined as neurogenic bowel dysfunction. Treatments are available, but still, almost half of SCI patients are dissatisfied with their normal bowel management routine, with as many as 71% of patients making no changes to their bowel routine for more than five years. But until now, healthcare professionals lacked a comprehensive tool to assess and monitor bowel treatment efficacy, instead relying on many different indicators to get a full picture of the patient's situation. Currently, only 30% of HCPs use the NBD score to assess treatment. And 48% of HCPs do not use any tool at all to assess treatment failure. To solve this problem, Coloplast teamed up with clinical experts in spinal cord injuries and neurogenic bowel dysfunction around the world to create a tool for monitoring bowel treatment efficacy and for validating it in a clinical setting. The tool consists of a questionnaire which is filled out and then plotted into a decision matrix or wheel. It encapsulates three core dimensions of bowel assessment. Objective symptoms, such as faecal incontinence, patient satisfaction, the subjective perception, and associated special attention symptoms, such as pain or bleeding. The HCP completes the questionnaire together with the patient to assess the efficacy of their current treatment. The decision matrix was redesigned into a wheel to make it easier to visualize the three dimensions. Based on these results, the mentor wheel helps to assess the efficacy of the current treatment, taking all three dimensions into account. Step one, the score is used to select the correct NBD range on the edge of the mentor wheel. Step two, within that range, the degree of subjective satisfaction expressed by the patient is selected. Step three, the mentor tool result is revealed, but there is still one more step to go. If the patient has none of the special attention symptoms, the mentor result marked no applies to the patient. But if they have one or more of the special attention symptoms, the mentor result marked with a yes and a plus symbol should be used. If the result is green, which means monitor, it indicates that the patient's bowel treatment is effective. Treatment change is unlikely to be needed, but routine monitoring is recommended. A yellow result corresponds to discuss, meaning that the patient's bowel treatment may be ineffective. A discussion should take place, which may or may not result in further investigation or treatment change. Red means act, and suggests that the patient's bowel treatment is ineffective. Further investigation is recommended, and a treatment change is likely to be needed. The explanations for each result are described in detail on the back of the mentor wheel, along with step-by-step -step instructions. Let's take a look at an example. This is Alice. Her HCP has filled out the questionnaire with her, and after adding up the scores for each section, settles on an NBD score of 11. Alice feels happy with her bowel health, and so decides on a good score for patient satisfaction. Without any special attention symptoms, Alice would end up with a green monitor score, meaning that her bowel management seems to be effective and that she and her clinician should just keep an eye on things. But because Alice has recently experienced an episode of autonomic dysreflexia related to her bowel problems, the HCP assesses that the result is in fact a yellow disgust score. The HCP discusses the situation with Alice and eventually recommends a change in her treatment. The mentor tool supports HCPs in determining efficacy of bowel treatment, which may increase the treatment satisfaction for SCI patients with neurogenic bowel dysfunction. You can find more information, including a publication that describes the creation and validation of the mentor tool at coloplast.com.